But like I said, let's get some examples of this goddamn circus besides just the double standard. We were talking about that army trainee hijacking a fucking school bus. Who the fuck hijacks a bus full of fucking kids? Winning. No. You suck. What kind of fucking asshole does that? Winning. No. You suck. Seriously. You suck. <laughs> oh my god. Let's get into this. Um... So Army Sheriff trainee arrested after hijacking the school bus. Uh, Columbia, South Carolina, AP. An Army trainee has been arrested after authorities say he boarded a South Carolina school bus with a gun Thursday and held the driver and elementary students hostage before letting them off the bus. During a news conference, Rich, Richland County Sheriff Leon Lout said that the incident started at around 7 a.m. near Fort Jackson, the U.S. Soldiers La Army's largest basic training facility located in Columbia. The trainee dressed in physical therapy clothes, ran off post, and escaped the rifle from the installation, Lout said. Deputies said then started receiving calls about someone standing on a nearby Institute flag down cars. The trainee then went on to a nearby bus stop where children were waiting to be taken to Forest Lake Elementary School, Lout said, and boarded the bus himself armed with the rifle <laughs> he told the driver he didn't want to hurt anybody he wanted him to drive to the next town <laughs> what kind of fucking oh what kind of fucking foobar fucking buddy fucking blue falcon piece of shit shit bag is this <laughs> you win a wall and <laughs> to make matters worse you committed fucking several acts of fucking felony kidnapping because <laughs> you decided to take a fucking school bus off winning no oh my fucking god you suck some of the 18 children on the bus 18 counts of fucking felony kidnapping on the bus began using cell phones to call parents to let them know what was happening lot said after some of the children asked repeatedly if the trainee planned to hurt them or the driver of the trainee got a little frustrated and ordered the bus to stop allow the driver and children to get off lot said he then drove the bus several miles before abandoning it with the rifle inside the man then went through the neighborhoods nearby lot said looking for clothes was subsequently spotted by deputies and arrested without incident <laughs> what a fucking clusterfuck bro like, you can't even do the army and you're running away from that bullshit you're running away from the easiest fucking stint in basic training you can fucking have and you think you can be like rambo and hijack a bus and car and make some fucking grand like fucking action movie escape Oh my fucking god, you're a fucking moron. Yeah, the man no. went through neighborhoods nearby, Lot said, looking for Chloe. Yeah, we already read that. Oh my god. A spokesperson for Richland, two school districts, said the bus was transporting elementary school children as a precaution. Security at multiple area schools was increased, and no one was allowed to enter or leave the building, he said. That is fucking retardedly absurd. This dude's a fucking idiot. This is the second high-profile incident in recent weeks involving a soldier based at Fort Jackson. Last month, a Fort Jackson soldier was charged with third-degree assault and suspended after an online video depicted him accosting and shoving a black man in his neighborhood. Winning. No. You really? suck. You, you're, you're having racist issues. You suck. And you're filled with a bunch of shitbags. <laughs> no. Oh, my God. Basic training is not what it used to be. Uh, Lot said the man in Thursday's incident was in his third week of basic training at the installation. You you made it two weeks. Like, you're out of red fate. Like, you're in white. Like, what the fuck, people? You are a fucking weak brick, bro. You are a fucking piece of garbage. You suck. Officials from Fort Jackson said they were cooperating with deputies. The trainee named has not been released, and Lot said he would face charges, including multiple counts of kidnapping. Like, oh my God, this dude is an absolute disaster. Um, you suck. So red phase where we were, that's when they fucking. I mean, well, I was in school knocks all male. It was a little bit harder. They've changed the rules and made it softer. Apparently, you can have your phones and shit now in basic training. So I don't understand why this guy's getting fucking crazy. Unless there's something wrong with the fucking. They're not saying and they're beating people or sexually abusing them or doing some type of retarded garbage. I, I don't see why somebody would escape with a rifle. <laughs> but the fact that he foobarred it the fuck up, like he fucked up beyond the fact that the situation was foobar, I don't think he could fucking, he was any good at the training. I think he was just a, a soft, weak piece of crap that went AWOL. Like a fucking piece of crap. You suck! I, mean, I don't think you should be joining the army at this point in time or the military because they're purging it of all, like, conservative thought and, like, making it a, like, leftist indoctrination enforcement machine. But, I mean, 
than F, the Nazi enforcement force. But to each their own. I mean, if you're going to make that type of commitment, you actually have to have that fucking type of commitment. That's how and winning you is done. Keep it going because otherwise, why should I respect you? Why should any of us respect you if you're not going to do what you say you're going to do? I mean, it really is that simple. Uh, ladies won't respect that. Men won't respect that. Children won't respect that. Animals won't respect that. You just give off that little dick energy. <laughs> <laughs> basic training was probably one of the hardest things i've ever had to do and it wasn't easy for me because i was a like scrawny little weekly man when i was a kid but i fucking did it <laughs> that's how winning it is i done. went to work i didn't fucking do any of the garbage like I, I went to the war zones i didn't fucking flee i didn't bitch out i came back after i was on r and &R. I didn't try to run away and my dog keeps fucking bugging me yeah, she's really going to, like, stop doing that and start listening. Sometimes she just, like, she gets jealous when I'm talking to you guys and not playing with her. But this is not the way. Like, the Mandalorian would be ashamed of you. This is not the damn way. <laughs> oh, my God. Winning. No. You suck. You need a knuckle down. You need to uh, reach down deep, pull out your ovaries or your balls, and you need to put on your big boy or big girl pants, and you need to nut the fuck up or man the fuck up or human the fuck up and carry out the commitment that you made because you signed a motherfucking contract and made a motherfucking commitment. That's how winning is done! <laughs> you signed an oath, you took an oath, uphold that damn oath. That's how winning is done! Otherwise, you're not winning. <laughs> this guy is definitely not winning. This is just an example of the goddamn circus. Just like fucking police shooting at a fucking baby. Yeah, no. And this shit gotta stop. This shit is absolutely asininely, absurdly ridiculous and unnecessary. Winning! No. You suck! Who decides to shoot at a fucking car with fucking babies in it? Winning! No. You suck! That's why you're not supposed to go on high-speed chases and shit anymore. You cause more harm than fucking damage. You killed a fucking child. But that's a different story. It's just like, this fuckery gotta end. I'm just fucking saying.